they are staring at you, but you have to look at them. Okay. Oh my god, in front of Benjamin Sugu has a lot of cafe and street food. No, yeah. What the heck? Uh, I just got here for, for the school. I've uh, known anywhere. I always lost. When you're walking straight from the front of the school, the first thing we will see on the left is the Benjanuson Auditorium, and next will be Suni Triangunsi Auditorium. Benjanuson Auditorium can be used as a room for various activities. It can also be used as a tasting auditorium. Suni Auditorium can be used as a room for various activities. Are used as an examination field, same as Benjanuson Auditorium, and next to it is the Buddha Shrine. Let's see, walk this way. Where are we going? Let's, Let's go! go! When you're walking straight this way, we will see Building 6 on the left. Building 6 is a school building for EEP students or Excellent Educational Program students. When we walk to the left this way, we will see Building 7 and Building 9 on the right side. Building 7 and Building 9, both these buildings, it is a school building for EP students or teaching and learning projects according to the Ministry of Education curriculum in English. Building 7 is for high school EP students and Building 9 is for middle school EP students. Goddess Sangam, behind the EP building, is another holy place where students here all go to worship. In EP Corset, this way, we will find canteen too. Why two? Because this school has two canteens. No? Why is the first canteen? Why can't you just wait? You are so annoying. When we walk straight from canteen two, we will see Building 10, or a six-story school building in the front. Building 10 is the building of the FLAP students, or a foreign language advanced program. Is this the place where you can buy Latio? Let's try. Let's try. I don't like spicy. When walking straight from Canteen 1, come to see Bia Building or Building 3 on the left. Bia Building is a building that has rooms for teachers of foreign subjects and language classrooms. After walking a bit further, we will see Puanat Building or Building 2 on the same side. Puanat Building is a building with a room for teachers in the Thai language class. You know what? This building has some ghost story. Really? Oh. Yeah, if you don't believe, go ask him. Bro. After walking a bit further, you will see Chakrapong Building or Building 1. Chakrapong Building, it is a school building for students of the YSP Project or Young Scientist Program. After walking a bit, we will come across the Maharat Building. Maharat Building is a building of the science group and a learning building for SMT students or enrichment program of science, mathematics, technology, and environment. Walking further from Maharat Building, we will find Sirinton Building of Building 5. Sirinton Building is a building with a monument of King Rama 5 or King Zulalongorn in front and it is a school building for AP students at France program. Continue walking from Sirinton building on this way you will find building 4 or Prashanat building. Prashanat building it is a building of social studies subject group and also have religion and culture. Walking from building 4 
you will find Building 8 or Shalom Prakiat Building. Next to Building 8 is a roundabout which has Spirit House of Ongdam or General Grayson Nava. It's another holy place that everyone worship. What are they doing? They do bad things. You shouldn't do this. Why? Because you will get like this. Why are you like this? Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of GQ Hugo Boss Model of the Year, Miss Bella Hadid. Thank you for watching. Why are you running? Action.